Miari, gena usakasakabo, hola y buenos dia, hello and good day. It's Elba again, aka Phoenix Taino, playing some more wakfu. Okay, hold on. Get that out of the way. Wait, where is this quest? Uh, I don't even have that. All the state nations, mini arc in the archies, secondary school, extra, astra, paraboria. Oh no, that was, okay, I finished the Gumi thing. Now what I have to do is get the heck out of here, because the ancient struggle says level 51 or higher. I'm level 55. But I don't even have the quest ancient struggle You know what? I think I think this is the one, like you said, that has to do with going in the caves and um, the gnome-looking characters and all that other shit that we were doing. Yep, that's exactly what this is. But I probably need to talk to this um, gnome lady first to actually have the quest activated. There's the little gnome guys with their little bells and stuff. Am I even going the right way? I don't... I don't know. This way? I think it's this way. We shall find out. Wait, let's look at the map. So I was kind of going the right way. I just didn't need to go that way. Well, eventually, just not yet. Da, da, da. Here we go. Nation of Amakna. Fairy Bell. Copperbeard. Mm -hmm. Hey, girl. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Talk to Cyrus at Miraboria. Dun, 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 dun. There's an exit this way, but like, to where? New Sufokian mine. Oh, interesting. Well, now I know how to get there if and when I need to. Probably should have this character fight a bunch of these little gnome guys so I can level up and whatnot. Oh, this is the way out, though. I'm pretty sure this is, the, yeah, this is the way out. Here, boy, a hobble. This repulsive breath damage 16 pushes back one cell. Yeah, because that turning around the target thing didn't really, doesn't really help. <sighs> What's this? Impalement. Go on that instead. So it heals summons. 
Start of turn, heal 10% of HP max of the target. Shares walk two points with the Osamotas. The summon spells cost only walk two points when the summon dies. I don't think I like that, to be honest. I'm just gonna switch you, because I don't really use you. 21, 16, 14, 28. So. You should be here. You should be here. Yeah. 30, 47. Oh, I need more earth. I have this whole dragon form shit that I don't even know. I don't know if I want to do that. Cast on summons. Cast on summons. Okay. I just want the ability to heal myself. Okay. So my poison moves are the strongest for shell. So wait, I should probably put switch this to here. <laughs> yep. With the treasure. Talk. Try to win. Bear fell over. End of flashback. Now I gotta go to the second floor. Which is this way. Through here, and then around. If I'm not mistaken, it's in this one room, right? Nope. Oh, I have to go to where that pool is. This way. Nope, oh, no! Wait, there's another area? The Hupper Garden. Wait, can I go there? Nope. Storeroom. Alrighty then. And I remember it's not there or anywhere else. It was here, I believe, that I needed to inspect for these for this cutscene. Seems like it's who said sweat balls? No, but it's clearly been opened and manipulated. Hmm, I heard a suspicious noise. Let's get out of here quick. Well, well, hoodlums. Look like we caught looks like we caught a snooper red-handed. I do be snooping. <laughs> Okay, we want to zoom out. 
and I'm gonna go here. You got a SRAM with no fucking face. That's kind of weird. fuck was that? Complete your turn with an even number of AP and an even number of MP. Oh, well, shit. That didn't happen, obviously. Oh, well. What is it? Was she... Oh. Ooh, I got those in before my time ran out. Okay, everybody. Ow! Ow! Weak to water, you're pretty even. You have no water. And you're weakest to fire, interestingly enough. Hmm. We gonna go this way. Take out the first person. Oh yeah, we decided that Earth would hurt more. Oh, I can't do anything anyway. Okay. That's a Sacrier. And that's a Yop. I think this is a Fekka. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. Can I? Nope, can't get you both. And you had like two bars. So I'm thinking you're a healer and I should probably take you out next. y'all can hang out with my dolls. Why I no can move? Whatever. That's all I can do? Something was put on my ass. Try, asshole, but like, you can go over there, actually. Yeah, you'd be healing yourself. We don't like that. Yeah, sit down. Sit down. Be humble. All right. Do the same thing. Yep, Becca. He's the tank. Yop is probably who I should get rid of next. There probably. Okay. What are you weak against again? 
weakest to fire. Well, I don't have fire. Next, water and earth. So I'm just gonna do this. You're gonna give me your health. Actually, I should probably do this. Ooh, run away! Oh no! I just realized one of my dolls is gone. This one's fit to be gone too. Come on! Let's just put him in the way. Yeah. Owie! You took your own friend out? That's crazy. With my little doll. What are you weakest to? Oh, you're literally the strongest. Which makes sense, you're a Fekka. Fekkas are basically tanks. What do I want? Probably that, but. I'm multitasking, guys. That's why I was letting the time. The time go. Hi. I heal myself. Can I heal from here? Oh, I don't even need to move. Make me stay close to my other dolls in case they need help. Which, you know, they shouldn't. I think I got this. I think. way to oh it's like you can keep messing with my dolls oh I win I did it now it says take the news to who said to say bald who said to say bald? You just look at the map. I don't know where to go. Oh, right, 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 right. We're going back to the... To the gentleman in the library. Guy, right, chow. Okay. Who does feel better when the library is nice and tiny, albeit with a bit of dust here and there? Or are you here to sort it out? I got attacked in the storeroom. It's becoming commonplace around here. It was so foreseeable. I told you to surprise them, not to get surprised by them. But I was very careful. There was nobody there. They can't humanly have gotten there that fast. Are you certain? 
Maybe you didn't look properly, absent-minded as you are. No, actually, I was very careful. There was no one anywhere to be seen. Hmm. That can only mean one thing. They have special ways of getting around the school. Secret passages. Blah, blah, blah. Secret passages that let them go from place to place fairly quickly while avoiding the professors. In any case, tell me more about your attackers. They were wearing long tunics which covered their clothes and hid their faces. What's more, they called themselves hoodlums when they were talking about themselves and their leader, which fits well with what I saw. <laughs> hoodlums. Hmm. I read some references about them recently. Reputedly. They have a flying structure which goes around the nations, and they attack poor travelers and take their money. This structure is known as the Zeppelantern. Their leader could well be on board it. I see you've done quite well so far. How would you like to get down to business and go take a look? I need more information about these strange individuals. That's child's play for an apprentice like me. This is giving very Harry Potter. Like, all these professors have abilities above and beyond their students, but they're sending their students to handle shit. <laughs> like, okay. Anyway, problems have they tried. Get through on your own. Meet up in front of the Zebel Lantern Dungeon in Volta. Wait, what's this? Where does this take me? Exit? Exit where? Sorry, when I said that I made myself, it made me think of uh, the latest season of Bridgerton. Spoiler alerts for those who haven't seen season three yet. But there's already clips of it everywhere. Um, where the one sister's like, insert himself. And set himself where? Oh, I need to open the door. <laughs> this girl was just outside with me. You gotta go this way. No. This way, then to the right, then this way. And back to Bontai go! Oh, there we go. Since I'm here, I might as well do that. Just in case. Just in case I have to do a battle. Where am I to go? Over here. So, thicket of your butt. <laughs> Sorry! <laughs> About a big butt. <laughs> oh my gosh. This is this is making me think that if I leave the country, maybe France would be a bad choice. <laughs> because like, they're so fucking funny. Okay. We are going to go this way. Oh, the mine is this way. I wonder if I can mine any of the things here. Because I know I can't chop down those cherry blossom trees. They're they're too high level for me. I haven't uh, increased my profession enough for that. What is bloodsucker tsutsu? And there's rats. What would you even mine here? Oh, look. Royal Bauxite. Level 50. Yeah, I need to level up more. Wait. Who is this guy? Let's talk to Barry. 
Oh, a visitor. What can I do for you? Nothing right now. Goodbye. Oh, okay. Why does it want me to go this way? I can't climb that. I don't think. Wait, I haven't touched this guy before. Look at that. Oh, wow. Okay. This is interesting. <laughs> There's a dungeon down here. And I gotta go all the way. So just go straight for a ridiculous amount of time. Hoodlum protector. Hoodlum mage. Oh. Oh, jeez. So, there's Hoodlum, so we're definitely going the right way. Sovereign Titanium. Oh, psh, definitely not. There's a lot of these Hoodlum uh, folks up here. And another Drago turkey. That's crazy because they don't show on the map until you activate them. So there's probably one over here too. And I may have passed one this way and didn't even notice. But, you know, it's, it's whatevs. It's fine. I don't see... There we go. Oh, that's just, that's not even a person. <laughs> Hoodlum Assassin, Hoodlum Protector, that's fun, I guess. Hooded Passage. Okay. Give a report to... Who said to say bald? Zeppo Lantern. Required level 156. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to do that. <laughs> I just got to 100. I'm just a baby. I do want to see if I can find... Monster Cage, level one. Oop. I don't know about all that. <sighs> okay, so... If we go... Puneta, this way... Maybe... Maybe I find another Drago Turkey? Around here somewhere. F freaking mosquitoes. I don't see a Drago turkey yet. That doesn't mean there isn't one. Oh, I must have to go around. Seriously? I can't hold there to say. Okay, it looks like I'm gonna have to s click on these switches, maybe? Oh, no, I don't. Like, maybe later on there's gonna be a quest where you have to, like, flip different switches to do different things. Okay, now we're back. Did I go all the way down this way? Uh-oh, what was that? weird. A uh, Drago turkey. I knew there had to be a whole other one. 
Oh no, that's the one I already... Is this the turkey I already touched? It is. How come it's not showing the other turkey? Oh, because it's all the way to the flim flam over there. Okay. Da da da. Perate. Perate. back. See, this is level 105. Can't do it! Not today. The stars are not in position! <laughs> okay. Oh shit. Am I going the right way? I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way. Oh, pendeja, you need to go to a zap, not the... Zap is this way, I'm fairly certain. Yes. Now I gotta, like, do this real quick. I didn't have to fight anybody, so... I'm going to put my phoenix back... My revive point back here in... So fuck yeah. And then... Now I'll go back to Rock Island. The Hopper Maid School. Hopper Maid School downstairs. We're going to go upstairs. This way. People are just leaving books around and shit. I found it. Okay, I don't need to. I don't need this now. Out. I know where he's at. Blah blah blah. I found the Zeppelin lantern, but I didn't find out anything about their plans. I think Hoodfellow was only one of our enemies' many henchmen long ago. Now they work separately. You've done well. As for me, I've been developing my theory about the hoodlums. What's your theory? From my research, I'm starting to get a better view of the mystery surrounding them. But do take into account the fact that they're are still things I don't know about them, and I still have to find out about this famous hood fella and analyze the details you observe. You'll observe in the Zeppel Lantern. Now that I've nuanced my words enough, listen closely. I'm listening. In my opinion, they could be hopper mages who have rejected our core values, who are focusing on the study of the magic of the world of 12 classes. But worse still, I think they have a set purpose and that they're doing this on the orders of someone far higher up than Hoodfella. For what little I know, it could be one of our own. But who could it be? Oh, that one teacher I accidentally stumbled into his room thinking I was in the right spot and I wasn't because your girl struggles with maps sometimes. Anyway, um... He, he had an evil vibe. He had a, like, I'm not a nice guy. I do shicey shit kind of like feel to him like the way he was designed and whatnot but then again I don't know that remains to be discovered but everything is linked I'm certain of it the school's downfall the hoodlum strange doings the attacks on students they all have the same cause and result you must find out who's behind it all and stop them as soon as possible very well I'll try to find out what's going on Shadowless point of light success! I did it! 
So then I have to do this puzzling the big sword, which requires five rustic candles, something I cannot make because I haven't leveled up. Uh, I think it's the weapons master profession. It's something like that. Is it weapons master? What we can just do this. Rustic. Yep, weapons master. I have to be a level 40 to be able to create that. I am a level 16. So I've been checking the market to see if anyone's selling a rustic candle or two, or ideally five. Um, and no dice. I haven't had any luck yet. I could go out that way, but that takes you to like the registrar's office and then you would be out here. The registrar's office. Ar <laughs> the registrar's office is in here. So I would have gone the other way, would have brought me in here, and then I would have come out this way. I tell you. If I go out this way, registration office, and then, boom. I'm gonna go to Astro and see if I can find find what I need in the market. Moments later.
Okay. So we did all that silently. Oh no! Trapper level 60. So I can't I can't do nothing. I'm gonna have to level up my trapper skill. Or profession, rather. It seems like Earth does more damage to these burblies. You know, cold bleeblies. Get it? <laughs> anyway. And the and the David Croquette. Davy Crockett? Yeah, that 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 was funny too, in my opinion. Is it bad that I think these little these little pigs are kinda cute? <laughs> I wonder what it looks like sometimes when you change. See? I wouldn't have realized that. That's why there's that red line there. Okay, I'm just gonna use this view just to make life easier for myself. A little less confusion, you know what I mean? And attack! And attack! And that's about as good as it's gonna get until the next round. No, stay away from me. Yeah, pet my doll. Don't attack me. <laughs> oh, okay. We see your evil eyes. What is it? Burblewee with the lurgy. Okay. Whatever, friend. I don't appreciate being pushed. We'll just go here then. Oh, it's not gonna let me. Okay. Ah, oh, man, I could have done my poison thingy, blah, blah, whatever. And I did not do that. Seriously? Jizz. Now we'll face this way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go on this side of you. Wait. Hold on, sometimes. See? Look how much easier that was. Why do you know do what I want you to do? That's weird. Anyway. It's interesting how sometimes you, you really do have to change the combat view just to... And... Oh, that didn't do anything. I just wasted time. go as far away from you as possible. Now that we know these red lines represent fencing. One more hit. Yes, we got two untreated fur from a burbly with the lurgy. How many do I have? It doesn't even say. Oh, yes, it does. Over here on the left. I have five. So this guy is by himself. This person is this person. This burbly is also by themselves. So I'm at full health, right? Yep. This should be quick and easy. I'll go ahead and go over here. Hold on, let's make sure. Actually, you know what? I think I liked where I was. Right here. I'm pressing the wrong button. <laughs> that explains that. Oh, you are not healing yourself. Oh. For <laughs> yeah, he totally did heal himself. Rude! Okay, we're just gonna go over here. Because 
what you're not gonna do is be right on top of my house. We just... Do that. Just because this means nothing can really hit me from behind. be able to heal back. There we go. That's that song. Okay. Might as well get him. Still full health. Just cool, 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 cool. Hmm. I feel like he's gonna be more of a jerk, so I should probably go here. I don't think these barriers will matter when I summon my dolls. It won't matter. Cool. That's good to know. Hold on, let me do this. Now I can see better. Because I'm pretty sure. Yep. Barrier does not matter. I should probably move. Hit him again. Do this. Nice. Okay. One, two. We're gonna go like over here. Cause I don't want to end up like messing myself up because I kept myself in that corner. You know what I mean? Ta-da! Three more. What's his name? Frozen Horn Bree Burbly with the Lurgy. Was this supposed to be a play on the word lethargy? I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I'm not picking up the pun here. And I feel like this is an utter failure. Like an utter nerd failure on my part. But it'll be... It'll be okay. to summon our dolls. We learned the hard way that not putting a healer... What is this? Oh, I didn't use all my MP. Eh, fuck it. We don't care. It'll be alright. Of course you're gonna come to me. That's fine. So I'm just gonna hit you from behind. Actually, let's do this. If you here, because then when I hit you from behind, I don't want to hurt my doll. So it's probably better if I do these. Yep. And this. And then run away! Oh. There we go. Ta da! And you're done! Oh, no you're not. Which will be the next move, because... I got you! How many do I have now? Eight. So, nine and ten. Are there any other, like, little groups? There we go, because these this group... That's a healer right there. 
Hopefully, I'll get at least two furs from this group of three. Finish off all enemies using close combat attacks. Yeah, that's not gonna happen. So that's not how I roll. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but I'm gonna come up here anyway. <laughs> should have gone after the healer first. So I'm pretty sure... What's her name? Nope. Same thing. Rude. Why are you pushing me? It's so mean. Ramble's not going to hurt me. And then... Wait. If I do this... Oh no, that's as good as it's gonna be. Okay, it's fine. Will I be able to from here? Oh, I did kind of pin myself in, didn't I? Definitely pin myself in because that, uh. Sorry, I just opened a can. Um. Now that pig can't move anywhere. There we go. Ta da! Let's move everybody. Well, that didn't do anything, though. <laughs> I was just kidding. I was just testing you. Can I hit that bleed leaf from here? No, I can't. But I can hit you from here. Since I already... Oh no, whatever will I do? Well, I can't do anything now. But I can... Help get her. Why do I only have one move? I don't like that. What it looks like. We up here. <laughs> hey! Yeah, I'm just gonna hit you. Wait. Let's do this. Get more than one of you at a time. Oh! Now I'm spilling shit. Ah! Not good. No! So, like, here? Yeah. Screw you! Yay, we did it! Um... Alright, I need to do this, and then this. For anyone who may or may not be wondering, um, I'm 100% using a touchscreen computer because the last time I played this game, which was like two weeks ago, my mouse started acting up and I was on the last level of a dungeon to finish the Sadita quest and I was, I was so upset that, um, 
that I was like, you know what? I need a break <laughs> from this game. <laughs> um, that and I was uh, training to learn more at my job. So um, I'm very much the kind of person that likes to have like a routine. I'm less likely to mess up if I stick to a routine. And because I'm going to be in a new department, that means change, right? New routine. And uh, I wanted to do that as well. So I was like, all right, new routine, break from the game. Then when I come back, I'll start playing on the laptop that we have that's touchscreen. Because my husband has a laptop, I have a laptop. One is touchscreen, one is not. So um, I was like, yeah, I'm going to play on the one that's touchscreen from now on. That's what I'm going to do. That way if the mouse starts acting up, it doesn't matter. Because I can just touch the screen to do my moves. But I digress. Bring the first to David Croquette in the Guild of Hunters camp. That is what we're going to do. Hey you, my name's David Croquette, Hunter of the Guild of Hunters. This place sure freezes the hairs on your chest, don't you think? What brings you to these parts? Here are your ten untreated furs from Burbley's with Lurgy. Mm -hmm. Here's your equipment. We're very grateful to Chilberg, so we'd like you to take some pure terudium to him. You can extract it from the area's ice cores. We're quits now. I'm off. Now that you've got the proper equipment, you can start harvesting samples of pure terudium from Sty for Stifen Chilberg. Which I'm pretty sure I'm not high enough level to be able to do because I remember coming this way this stuff I need to be a level 65 miner that's not gonna happen so so I have to I have to mine them myself I can't just go to a store and buy 10 10 samples or whatever because then the first part of the quest won't have been completed. These things look kind of cool. Oh, they're they're cracklers. Crack might, crack tight, crack chalk. Interesting. Like stalagmite or stalactite, the things that you either find on the ceiling of caves or on the floor of caves. Because your girl is Taino, so you definitely know some things about caves. Wait, bait extractor. Oh, this is what I'm supposed to grab. Huh. All right, so I was uh, mistake on. Wait, no, go back. There's another one. I see another one. There we go. I just need to do ten of these. Two. clicked here, didn't I? Pretty sure. This is six. I know there's a seventh one over here. Some of the sounds in the game are reminding me of Trove. Wait, that's not gonna work. Ooh, what was that? Oh. Eight. Wait, do these refresh? Is that what I'm hearing? Wait. 
No, I'm going the right way. Pretty sure I'm going the right way. He was down here next to the dock, wasn't he? Am I remembering wrong? Yeah, no, there he is. He's right here. Okay. I'm crazy, but I'm not that crazy. Hello, Mr. Enutroff. Hello, my friend. Welcome to my ice flow on the aptly named Chilberg Island. I'm looking for people who want to invest in my business. Are you interested? I will bring you some pure terudium. Terudium. I don't know. Thank you for bringing me this pure terudium. I would have happily given you my climbing gear in exchange, but something terrible has happened. Go on, tell me. But afterwards, I'm going to find a way into that tower to enjoy its spoils. I fear that my activity is nearing its end. A band of pirates stole some of my cargo. All I have is this map, which shows the location of their camp. I'll give you the climbing gear if you help me. Give me the map already. I'll go and get your cargo. Ta-da! Find the pirate slayer to the east of Chilbert Island. Find 10 stolen cargo in the pirate's place. Take the stolen cargo to Chilberg. Ask Chilberg for some climbing gear. Nice. I thought I had to be higher level. See, Google be lying sometimes because you got to be careful. If you go to Google to look things up with regard to Wakfu, pay attention to the different um, posts and whatnot that come up, like the year that the post was made and that the responses are being given because a lot can change in a year. I could have sworn that when I Googled this, it said uh, to get the climbing gear, you had to be like level 110 or something like that. But apparently not, apparently not. So we're good. The god Enutroph is starting to get on Chilberg's nerves and on yours by proxy. Having heard about the price of Terraudium on the world's markets, a band of pirates has stolen the explorer's merchandise. You've been looking forward to giving those pirates a good kicking ever since that episode on the Dark Hurl. When you're done, you should finally get the climbing equipment you need to explore the rest of the island and uncover its hidden treasures. Noise. Alright, so... Pirate's Lair... Is that what I had to climb down to get to? Because I, I feel like the pirate's lair was down here. And that's why I needed the climbing equipment to begin with. So let's see. Let's see if my guesstimation is correct. Can I climb down now? Will it let me? No. So it can't be there. Where is the lair? Well, there's definitely something over here. I'm pretty close. Let's go check it out. Just, you know rule out this area. And there's not really anything here. Hmm. I really want to know what's making that noise. Okay, there go all the pirates. <laughs> I wonder where I must go now. Because I can't go anywhere else on this map. Without, I guess, being able to climb down and go into this snowbound, snowbound, snowbound village. Went there, but what's over here? This looks like an area that I should 
potentially investigate. At least see. Oh, cool, look. I just realized that this is connected to a dragon fossil thing? I don't know. <coughs> Pirate's Lair. Look at that shit. I found it. I found it. Alright, let's go in here. Dun, 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 dun. And of course, lots of pirates. We have srams and rogues. Find ten stolen cargo in the pirates. I'm assuming I'm gonna get attacked when I search through some of the stuff. Or maybe not. Oh no, they're finding me. They see me. Damn it, man. Why this no let me? Oh, because I'm pressing the wrong button. Am I pressing the wrong button? It's just the one rogue? <laughs> Look. There's some, there's some whiskey. Alright, I think... It is as good as it's going to get here. Freezing. Oh yeah, we'll figure that out later. Fight has begun. you weak against again? Oh, psh, shit. You don't even know. Oh, yes. Girl. Just run right past his ass. He's facing that way, so we want to attack this way. 200 damage each time. Oh, no! There's another one. I'm less afraid of the rogues than I probably should be. Hold on, we wanna... Okay. Put you here. And I can put you... Oh! Interesting. That was interesting. Do I have it set to where my dolls explode when they die now? That might have been something I did that I completely forgot I did, because I did not remember that. I definitely did not remember that. I can't go that way. So I guess I'm going to come this way. Still hit you? No. No. I don't like it. Rude. You can all take that. And take that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Poison you from here too. We like doing things from a distance. Well, I should probably go this way. That way, I don't get in the way of my other dog. Yeah. Yeah. Sit down. Be humble. <laughs> Alright, so we got three of these crates. And I guess the more of them that I touch, the more they're going to come after me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Is it just the one SRAM? So I fought three before, but I had, I had, I think I had inspected or opened three crates. So I guess every crate I'm going to end up getting attacked by somebody. That seems to be the way this mission is set up. So. Week to Fran. We don't even know. So let's give some help. 
from you. Oh, it doesn't give it to my greedy, though. That sucks. Ta-da! Ta-da! Rude. Now it's gonna give me the help. Apparently not. Okay, so how many do I have now? Seven. And there's three more that I would need to grab. One, two, three. And now I'm gonna get attacked by three of them. Okay, interesting. Looks like my theory is, is holding some kind of water. Or does hold water. Oh, look at the fish. He's got his tongue sticking out in the in the ice like, ah, I'm dead. <laughs> oh, jeez. Anyway. Go ahead, bro. Get close to me. It's a bad idea, but... Do you, friend. Real smart. How come I no can hit you both? Can I hit you both? No. You know what? I should summon my other doll first and foremost. And do this. Which gives me more. <laughs> that, that, that makes more sense. Alright, you can go here, because then I can kick you, and then turn around and kick you. Yes. Will you be too far? Nope. I win. I got my cargo. Take the stolen cargo to Chilberg. Ask Chilberg for some climbing gear. And just like that, Lola's gone. <laughs> okay. You going the wrong way, friend? There we go. Just stand next to go stand next to him. Ta-da! Hello, my friend. Welcome to my ice flow. Oh, we read that already. I have your stolen cargo. Do you have my climbing gear? <laughs> a deal is a deal, my friend. So here's your equipment. Have fun in the gorge and happy treasure hunting. Don't hesitate to bring me some more terraudium. I've always got something for generous investors. Here we go. Nice. Use the climbing gear at the Gorge Plateau. Explore the ruins of the Aspara, Aspara Gorge. Now that you've recovered the mountaineering equipment, descend into the gorge and find a way to access the tower and its long lost treasures. Does that mean climbing down into the Snowbound, Snowbound Village? Was that the name? Was it Snowbound, or did I just like... Yeah, Snowbound. Wasn't sure if I was remembering correctly. I'm gonna go here, and then here, and then here. Uh, do 
I vote? No, 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 no. Yep, it's good. Now, now it lets me go down. Ta-da! Yes, explore the ruins. Oh, follow the footprints, clearly. As surprises go, this is pretty surprising. It looks like a village once stood here. But where are the people? But where are the people? There's a creature dressed... A little like a priest standing by the ruined church. And it looks like it wants to talk to you. Perhaps it knows more about what happened here. Well, we'll see, I guess. That's... Okay, there's a lot of... Wait, these are... Yeah, these are... These look like skeleton guards. What creature... Oh, these guys. That's where these, um... Crobamoon... Bohemoon... Enraged Bohemoon. Are these... Oh, so like the crows and the boo wolves, just like the cold version, just like the frozen version of these bitches, is is what they are. Okay, that works. Large wood lathe. Wait, what's over here? A bill. Father. Deep boar. Okay, let's talk to him. Hello, little Chiblain. Welcome to the Snowbound, Snowbound Village. Excuse me, um, father? But I... you're... Don't be shy, my child. Old Father Deepor only wants what's best for you. But quickly now, we need to get you to shelter. The waters are rising and hordes of chafers are at the castle gates. It is the end of the world, the Great Flood, chaos! You've got 200 years to catch up on, Father. You must need a rest. Mm -hmm. You digress, my child, and Mrs. Freeze... Mrs. Freeze's armies are marching across Frygost ever nearer, but have no fear, for I have barricaded the only way into the castle, and no more will come. But the Count won't stop there. His dofus endows him with almost godlike power. Frygost? Godlike power? Give me the key. I'd like to pay this little nobleman a visit. Nah. You're out of your mind, my sweet. Mrs. Freeze would destroy you long before you got to the castle. We need a real army, which means we must start by treating all the wounded in my clinic. Take my key and go. You'd be better off coming with me. I think the cold has affected your brain. Okay, enter Father Deepor's clinic. Find a clue concerning the snowbound passage. It makes it all makes sense now. You're on the legendary island of Frygost. According to Father Deepor, the ice dofus is at the top of Count Herborg's castle. Unfortunately for you, since the second burial, the only way to access it is to go through the log basement of the manor at the end of the village. The manor is now home to a certain Mrs. Freeze, a former lieutenant of the Count. She leads an army of chafers. Father Deepor kept a register in the clinic under his church. Have a look through it and see if you can find any more clues. The Mrs. Freeze is giving Mr. Freeze from Batman. That's what it's giving. That's what it's giving. So I'm thinking that that area I was looking at earlier, is this where I need to go? Perhaps not. Did I pass where I was supposed to? Well, considering he is here, then perhaps where I'm supposed to go is further down? It does look like a village here. Okay. Oh, shit. I just realized I leveled up. Level 101. Frozen wood. Level 65. Okay. Ooh, that looks creepy. Deformed crack might. And that's why it's deformed. I'm looking very creepy. Okay, maybe here? A large stove. Okay, so this is a whole ass 
here? Nope, that's a dungeon that we don't want to go into. At least not yet. That's an oven. I should open my map. It probably tells me exactly where I need to go. The Choo Choo Harbor Castle Corpse. So I... Oh! Here? Let's examine that. Okay. Excerpt from the Rum Road. After a few weeks at sea, sailing against winds and tides, Captain Haddock, Haddock and Roll finally set foot on dry land. His ship's holds are full to bursting with his incredible find, the elixir of the sea's automized rum. It doesn't take long for the surrounding Sufokian population, so used to the calm of the place, to come see what all the fuss around the captain's newly famous drink is about. The rumors are quick to spread from Brackmar to Bonta, and people are hurrying to get their hands on a flask. Even as far as the Frygoskian hinterlands, the craziest rumors are going round. And then comments from Captain Tankerus. You freshwater dogs, the real recipe is mine. A good old homemade cocktail for real men. No quarters. This is no joke. Without me and my Frogossian recipe, these stupid village folk would freeze inside out when drinking this rum. No thank yous for old Tankerus, though. They're all too busy telling the story of Captain Haddock and Roll. And mumble, 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 not even a discount at the pub. Damn. Now what? No, it still says corpse. But where is the church? Oh, right here. The in basement? I don't know if I would have seen that. I wonder if I walked... Okay, a distillery. I wonder if I walked past anything else that had an entrance to it and I didn't notice because everything is, uh... Everything here is blue! Alright, so this is... We got a choo-choo train. Which I feel like is going to take me somewhere cool, probably. Let's keep exploring just to see what we have around here. Hunter's camp thing. That's the train that will do what? Frygoth Station. We'll have an island inside Grandpa Station. Ice Flow Station. Sadida Kingdom Station, Pandalusia Station, Sufokian Station, Limey, Moon, Brackmar, Bonta, Machna. So Ice Flow and Inside Grandpa are two places I haven't been before. Everywhere else I've been, I haven't been to the station in those areas. At least not that I was aware of. This is the Snowbound Manor. Do I want to go in there? Mm. Something tells me I don't need to be in there right now. Where's the church? Abandoned cart? Should I look at that? Time worn freeze pop. Wait, I have... I think I have that. No. Wait. Should I be wearing this? Yes. Oh, look at that. She looked cute. A workshop. Ice metal pickaxe that I don't have. At least not on me to be able to go in. Why doesn't the map show? Where? I probably walked past it. Let's go back to that corpse guy. Watch the church be like 
right in front of what he, where he was standing, and my special self was like, I want to explore! Wait. That's exactly what the case was. I'm supposed to go in there. Oh my goodness. Well, better late than never when it comes to figuring it out. I want my cute outfit back. I don't, I don't like this outfit. There we go. That's better. Why? Desk. Well, clearly I gotta click on this. Read. Okay. <gasps> We have traveled through time. As you read Father Deep War's notes, you find yourself drawn into the past, to the time of Ogress chaos. Try to find out where the key to the snowbound portal is as you tend to the survivors from the village. Treat air peace. <laughs> Hair peace. <laughs> uh, treat Mayor Cantile. Mercantile. Okay. Treat Captain Tigris. Cantankerous. I like. Oh, the dawn are cold. Oh, I gotta treat all these motherfuckers. Okay. So just treat everybody. We're gonna go with the ones who are. And why are the dead rising again? I wouldn't want to come back. Death is just a good long rest. Okay. Let's head back to the library. We should be safe over there. It's high up, and there are plenty of books to burn if we're cold. Okay. All I've... Like, Olive. The truth is, it's all the Count's fault, as if it wasn't enough that he'd frozen time on Frygrost. Geoffrey. Geoffrey. Like, Jeffrey. Okay, I see. I see. Very, very cute. Okay, Jean-Pierre Cough Cough. <laughs> Bless you. Why are the gods so angry? Is it because of the water clock? Or Herberg's pact with Jiva? Jiva? We're gonna go with Jiva. Lisa Gaia. My little boy stayed at the quay. Please, oh Aya, please keep him safe. I don't know why I said IOP like it's not pronounced YOP. It's terrible. The end is nigh. Oh, poor thing. Come here, little craw. I'll help you. What is that? Mayor Cantile. Yeah. We should never have stopped praying to the gods. I knew it. Lou. Lubricant. <laughs> or Lou. Ricante. Either way, lubricant. <laughs> the quay was flooded with two out within two hours. The village is our last refuge. That or Hairbird Castle. Hippolyte thermia. Hypothermia. Hypothermia. I get it. I get it. First, we heard a great dull thud, and then big waves appeared. And. Air peace. Hairbug freeze. Nyliza. Silard. They're all the same. Bunch of crazy fools. We're in this mess because of their inventions. And then speak to Father Deep Boar. Who's clearly this person. If we want to survive, we need to treat everyone as soon as possible. This apocalypse is proof that the gods are angry. We should have spent more time in prayer. I've treated them all. It's perfect, but I fear that the dead are rising. We'll see about your key later. In the meantime, head to the library. Here's the code to the lock. You can take care of the adults, and I'll take care of the children. To the library, then. Let's go. Wait, but we need to go back because there was something else that I could do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There was something else. Ta-da! Where is the key to Hareburg Castle? The key to the castle? What for? There are more urgent matters at hand. Treat all the people you see here, and then we'll talk about the key. No problem. Nah. Well, I already did that. We're not doing it again. All right, now it says go to the library to find the key to the buried passage. Search the books 
for a clue about the location of the key. Was that the other building that I stumbled upon? I don't remember. the inn. And that was like what a hunter area? Yeah. And then if I go this way, this has no entrance. At least a visible, not a visible one. Okay. That's the workshop. This is the Choo Choo. That's the castle. So maybe... There's workshop. Dang. This is sad. Don't want to go into the manor. Where is the library? Skeleton in the snow. Oh, okay. That's the mini game. I was like, this? What is this? What a jerk. somewhere that guy hasn't been. There we go. Number five. Ta-da! We're good. Where is this library? I don't know. Maybe if I get closer to the other guy, I'll see another building that I overlooked. Something else I overlooked without meaning to. Nope, that's a dungeon. That's not it. Wait, no, that's not it either. Oh, what's over there, though? There's something over here. What's over here? Is there something up this way? Maybe? No. That's not it. Just to get out of here. What is this? Turn off. Oh, okay. Cool. It's just a lamp. Maybe if I talk to him, he'll point me in the right direction. I don't know. Mm -hmm. 
Wishful thinking. Mm -hmm. uh, oh shit, I don't have enough to pay for the roof repairs. The Fragostians are losing faith. No one attends services anymore, and the church offer church coffers are empty. If you want to help, do the quest in the village and bring me as many ice commas as you can. No problem, I'll go and remind them of their religious duties. All right. Okay. Mm -hmm. But how come the village is doubly snowbound? Is that your church? Looks kind of drafty. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, I already did that. That's the one I had just clicked on. And then? And this one, yours one is a ghost, if you want my honest opinion. Mm -hmm. I don't need your opinion. I need willing young souls who are prepared to pay tribute to the god who gave them life. Do you want to tell me about the life you had before you died? Mm -hmm. Die? Me? You mad? I can't leave you like this. Well, apparently I'm gonna. <laughs> Apparently, I am gonna. Oh, where the is it? Is the library in the manor? Search the books for a clue. Or maybe I'm supposed to go back in there. And that same, maybe I was never supposed to leave that one building. Where was I initially? Which building did I go in? I don't remember. This is not good. Uh, or was it in the in basement that I saw the thing to read and then... No. No, it was the basement next to old buddy who isn't aware that he's dead. At least he doesn't seem to be aware that he's dead. This way. Ooh, I'm gonna go back in here. No, there's nothing else. I'm confused. Like, where the where where am I supposed to go? Hold on, let me look at the map and see if I can pinpoint what looks like an area that I may not have messed with. Oh, I wonder if it's... this looks like some steps, maybe? Should I go that way? I don't know, let me see what else I find. I'm so confused. Hmm. <laughs> okay, I don't. <sighs> oh, wait. Wait, 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 wait. It's been here the whole time. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Alright. The building with all the books around it. Go figure. That's the library. Oh gosh. It's embarrassing. I'm gonna read this and... Look at that. Tell Father Deeper you're ready to fight Mrs. Freeze. The book you found in the library tells, tells the story of Father Deep Boar and his resistance against the tyrannical Mrs. Freeze. Perhaps if you keep reading to end, to the end, you'll find out what he did with that flipping key. Sir, Frygostian friend, I need you. I need you to help me out. We're under siege, trapped like rats. The terrible Mrs. Freeze and her hordes of chafers are about to launch one last devastating assault. I'm ready to fight, Father. I won't let that icy maiden chill our bones. 
Where is the key to Hareburg Castle? Calm down, little one. I hid it in one of the secret books in the library, and while I live, it will not leave that hiding place. Oh, okay. Okay. I'll click on that other option that we're ready to fight. Are you sure you're ready? We're talking burning desire here, because there's no going back, and it's no use counting on peace, cantile, and Lou. They're in no condition to fight. I'm not afraid of anything, father. Wait, wait, wait. Is that me? I am not myself. And I gotta fight this bitch? Kaya, Mrs. Freeze. Lovely. Why do I feel like I should be over here? I feel like I should be over here. You're the sneaky type R and chew. Well, so was Hairbird. Kill, kill, kill. Oh, jeez. Oh, so you're gonna help me, Father D4? Is that what's happening? I don't even know what I can do. Well, I guess I might as well beef myself up. Okay, nothing cool visibly happened, but I did give myself 300 elemental mastery in doing all that. Rude? Oh, I can jump? Why I didn't do that before? Like a pendeja. Of course you're gonna summon somebody else. Yeah, bitch. Minus zero HP. So apparently these guys aren't doing any damage to me at all. Oh, minus one HP. <laughs> oh, Jesus. That's not good. Oh, no. Is this one of those no matter what you do, you're gonna die situations? <laughs> like... I feel like that's what this is. No, it doesn't go any that. Get me a shield. How much? Oh shit, that's a lot of. And then this. No, no, no. 800. So I can kill these guys. I wonder if killing them somehow. Okay. Why are you pushing me closer to this bitch? Now I'm stuck. And I can't do anything. That's lovely. Can we like... Wait, there's three of them now? Oh no! No, father! I'm gonna mute myself so no I'm dying so many children remember this frost got wait no come back the benefits of chastity and frigidity this will open many doors if you survive yeah this is one of those you gonna die no matter what situations I'm about to say ain't no way the benefits of chastity and frigidity. This is the book where the key is. Okay. In the Frigosian flashback, you clearly heard Father Deepor tell you where the key was in the stack of books detailing the benefits of chastity and frigidity. Take this key and head to the heart of the ancient continent of Frigos, Hareburg Castle. Okay. All right. Ta-da! I got the key. Go through the snowbound manor to reach Hareburg Castle. Okay. Oh, right, right, right. 
Again, I'm about to, I'm about to start chewing, so I shall now mute. Here. Oh, it's a dungeon. Ambassador's wing. Oh, yeah, no. That's not gonna help. What's down here? The frozen passage. And another dungeon type situation. I don't think I want to go in there just yet. <laughs> I think I'm going to need friends. I will probably not survive this area by myself. So, I'm going to go back out of here. And see if I can't do some different lower level quests that I have not completed yet. go down there. <laughs> I just realized that somebody fell. <laughs> There's like the imprints of someone's body having like face down into the snow. That's that's pretty funny. <laughs> dungeon in the city of the kingdom. The thing that made me so mad last time. I think I'm going to go ahead and pause here. Grab, finish eating my, my snacky snacks and then I'll come back. Yep. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. Okay, bye!